My name is Winshat Ibrahim and uh, I came from Ethiopia. I am married, uh, I have two kids. Um, I came here in the uh, US uh, about a year ago and uh, um, I'm an artist. Most of the time, I just uh, paint my art with what I feel inside. It's just I use my art to express myself. The idea of this painting is, uh, it is, as you see, it is between the uh, desert and green area. I just uh, want to see the contrast between them. And uh, in this area, we see that a little plant is coming out that means I just want to show hope um, someday in some some way in your life you might lose uh, <clears throat> something that you 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 you, you want to have but um, if you work hard and if you keep on uh, doing what you have if you keep on expressing what you have inside of you then you will see some hope this is uh, based on, I paint this painting based on Ethiopian landscape. The reason why I paint this painting is that it's just to introduce what Ethiopia has um, to the outside world. I'm not coming from the rural part of Ethiopia. It's a small town which is called Nazareth. I was born and grew up there and uh, um, uh, after uh, I grew up there, I married and came to the main city, Addis Ababa. Um, th that's my life history in short. <laughs> this painting is uh, a painting which uh, I paint based on uh, Ethiopian culture. Uh, this is in Ethiopia, it is called Masob. Uh, which uh, people usually use it to put um, Ethiopian bread in it and to put some different kinds of valuable material in it. It is made by women and uh, the idea of this painting is that uh, I just, if you see here, I just put a head of women to show that it is made by women and uh, she, she girded here to show that her strength, she had to do uh, this work, um, you know, it, she, she has to sacrifice and she, after, to, to, to make this uh, material, by the way, uh, it is made by a kind of grass. It is not like a grass you see in the neighborhood here, it's almost long, long grass. And uh, after that grass passing through several stages, it will be colorful and uh, it, this material is going to be made out of that grass. When I came to uh, US, uh, Boston is my first impression. Um, I have never been anywhere else uh, than Ethiopia. Well, this is my first time to be in the outside world. And uh, as soon as I came to Boston, um, I saw the Zaykum Bridge and uh, uh, it impresses me a lot. I saw the beauty of Boston and 
I just try to paint the Zaycom bridge, but uh, I just want to add a little more that make it more beautiful. Um, and uh, as you see here, I just use uh, flexible and beautiful women, which I believe that she represents um, Boston. And, um, and also women is uh, an image of beauty. And uh, when I see the Zaycom Bridge from far away, it just looks like a, a dress, long dress of women. So the, the, this is the thing that impresses me most. And uh, it's also to show the beauty of Boston. Um, as I told you before, uh, uh, Boston is my first impression. And uh, uh, when I came to Boston, it's about fall time. And uh, uh, I have seen for the first time in my life uh, a snow. And uh, it was a 2013 blizzard, I guess. And uh, I just want to uh, paint um, something based on that idea and uh, I want to tell you that I love snow so much especially fresh snow um, because I believe that it is so peaceful you don't hear it falling down you just when you just open your window it's uh, you, you just see uh, white so so I like it so much and uh, I like fresh snow but I, Afterwards, it's just when it's accumulate, it's just uh, something else. <laughs> I am a follower of uh, um, Jesus Christ, and uh, I just don't know how to mix this uh, my paintings with the with my with religion. But uh, if you see all my paintings, are they are based on hopes and beauty? Uh, the reason why I wanted do is that um, I just want to give hope for people. I just want to share uh, nice things that, that comes out of me. Anybody can be through, can pass through with any kind of obstacles and uh, any kind of hopelessness, but I just want to show, I just want to um, um, give hope for the people uh, for anybody uh, which sees my paintings. The idea of this painting is based on Bible story. Uh, there was a, a great person who is Moses. Uh, he was a great person of God. He was a great servant of God. It is a new moment for Moses because uh, this moment uh, in particular is the moment that uh, Moses heard the voice of God. Uh, Moses was, uh, as uh, uh, we know, he's a shepherd. Um, when he goes to the Mount of uh, God, he saw that the bush is burning, but the bush is not consumed by the fire. That's the moment that he heard the voice of God. And um, uh, when he heard the voice of God, as you see here, he just took off his sandals because God spoke to him, this is the holy ground. The idea of this painting is that um, it's just to show our surrounding, our environment, because we are surrounded by shapes and colors and uh, different kinds of things that we observe through our eyes. And that's what I want to show that it, it is, it has uh, so many colors, different kinds of colors, different shapes. It uh, is just to express that our eye is the reflection of our environment. Um, being an artist and mom is uh, a little bit uh, difficult uh, for me, I mean, in particular, because um, um, I didn't tell you about my husband, and uh, uh, he is a, a nice person. Um, he's very supportive um, in any way I need him. He just, you know, if I am busy on the day, if he stays home, he just wash the dishes, take care, taking care of the kids, and he supports me a lot.
if it weren't him, if if I was uh, without him, I, it would be more difficult. And uh, yeah, my kids are also, they are very nice kids. You know, they, they just listen what we told them to do. And uh, um, of course, it makes me busy. Um, but because of my husband, um, he's always um, helpful and he's always there. Um, to support me and uh, that is not that much difficult for me. This is the nude women and uh, the reason why I paint this painting is uh, I believe that and everybody thinks that um, a woman is a, a, an image of beauty. So I just want to show that when she uh, is uh, standing on the window and she starts, she tried, she's, you know, it's trying to open the shutter and uh, that's the moment when she just took off her hand, her towel just dropped off. This is the moment that I just want to draw. It is, as you see, it's a dry tree, but if you see it on the bottom of the tree, there are a little green um, herbs around it. It's just to show um, that this tree it, it didn't die. I mean, it's just it has life in the root. So even though it is dried up, the, even though the leaves are falling down, but this tree shows um, that it has life. Uh, when I came to Boston, I have seen that uh, uh, all the trees were dried up. Uh, I mean, they, they don't have any leaves, but yet they are living. Uh, in some season, all of a sudden, that I have seen that all the trees which were dried up became alive again. And uh, that is, uh, show me that uh, some moments that you you may feel that you are dried up, you, you, you lose hope. But inside of you, if you, your root is alive, then there is a probability that you will be alive again. Um, I have two kids uh, who, who are four and ten year old. And uh, uh, whenever they see me painting, they just uh, compliment on something, especially the, el the elder one. He said something, he says something, and I find it that compliment uh, is sometimes makes uh, a change uh, on my painting. And he sees, he sees painting, he, he knows arts. The little one, also the four-year-old, do his own, you know. He has, um, especially the little one, has a fantasy for music. And uh, they have, I guess, they have an art interest. This is cultural dress of Ethiopia. And uh, I believe it is uh, something uh, that Ethiopia has. It is an asset. And uh, I just didn't just show all the, the, the uh, dress, but I just need the idea of it. And I just want to, you know, um, express it in the way I want it to be. You know, our surrounding is full of, you know, you see, you heard what you heard and what you see is most of the time is danger, killing, and, uh, you know, it's full of uh, bad things, um, which is not constructive. And uh, I want my paintings to be constructive and hopeful. Um, beauty. I want to give what I have inside of me. That um, what I have is this beauty and hope.